For all the times that you rain on my parade And all the clubs you get in using my name you think you broke my heart, oh girl. Hi girls, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to go ahead and talk to you guys about the new CoverGirl True Blend Face Primer for Oily Skin. I was at the store last week and I was at Fred Meyer and I was going by the CoverGirl section and I saw this primer and I was like, um, and it said new on it so I wanted to go ahead and give it a try. Um, I am oily skin. I normally use um, the Nivea Sensitive um, Primer that Nikki Tutorials had mentioned before, so I wanted to give this a try, and so far it has been my ultimate favorite primer. One, it's super um, affordable, and it actually makes my makeup last a lot longer. Um, but I do want to give this a try because anything that is affordable and that we can save some money on, I want to give it a try. And it's new. So why not, right? <laughs> so today I'm going to go ahead and apply it on my face. I am going to be really busy from 12 to about 7 at night. So I will definitely keep you guys posted. Um, and I will record myself throughout the day um, to see how my face is looking. Um, so I'm really excited to give it a try. Um, I have no foundation on, no primer, nothing on my face except my moisturizer. So I'm going to go ahead and apply this on my face. It kind of reminds me of like a lotion um, feel. So it doesn't feel like a silicone, um, which is what I kind of like for primers. But the Nivea one is also runny, um, but it's clear. This one has more of like a lotion um, feel to it and the color is more pigmented. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and just apply it around my face. It feels kind of um, like dry, like dry. I don't, I don't know how to explain the texture of it, but it's it's runny, but it feels very like what I feel it on my face right now, and it feels like it's like going like this to my pores. Um, that's a good sign, right? Um, so we'll definitely see how it works throughout the day. Um, so I will definitely give you guys posted right now. I'm gonna go ahead and apply my foundation. I'm going in with Mac Studio Fix Fluid in NC20. And I'm going to apply that all over my face. I'm going to be taking a Morphe foundation brush. So far it feels really good on my face. Um, it doesn't feel any different with any of my other primers um, that I normally use. So that's a good sign. Um, normally when I apply primers that are not very good quality, um, my foundation tends to spread on my nose area. And on my chin area but definitely this has not done that yet um, let's just hope and pray that I don't get oily I'm a very oily person like I mentioned before like in my t-zone area and around the perimeters of my face but it doesn't feel any different um, it actually feels pretty good it feels light it feels normal um, so I can't wait um, to show you guys the end results and hopefully it doesn't you know get oily on me it's 10 55 um, a.m. Um, so I'm gonna update all of you like around three. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna get a little break, um, and then I will, um, and then I will record myself once I come back um, at seven, or oh, like seven thirty. So let's hope that it turns out just fine and that it looks fabulous because I will be saving some money. I'll up with you guys later on um, to see how this holds up for me. So far, like I said, so so far so good. So. Let's help and pray, please. So I love you guys and I'll catch you guys in a couple of hours. Hi guys, so as I promised, I was gonna update you on the primer, how the primer is doing, and so far, actually, so good. Um, right now, it is 4.47 p.m. and it's actually holding up pretty well. I don't feel oily, I don't feel greasy, um, so I'm super impressed for this drugstore primer. Because um, I don't feel any different than I would with my other one. So that's actually a really good sign, right? Um, so I'm so far liking it. Uh, we still have until I get home at 8. So we still have three more hours. Hi guys. So it is... I'm officially back home. So it's 10.22 p.m. And I've been wearing this primer ever since 11 a.m. 
So I'm going to let you guys know that I'm actually pretty impressed by this primer. Um, I didn't think I was going to like it very much because, you know, I'm very iffy when it comes to um, drugstore primers because I feel like they never work on me. Though. But this actually worked pretty well for me, you guys. It holds my foundation pretty well. Um, I do I do seem to be really um, shiny like in my T-zone area um, a little bit more than I do with my other ones um, and I saw that I got oily and under my eyes too. I would probably just rock this during the week when I don't want to wear so much makeup. The foundation is still on. Um, it hasn't um, it hasn't spread um, so my nose area is normally where my um, foundation does separate um, when I start to get oily. Um, so I can definitely recommend this you guys for, um, for oily skin. Um, and you save money. I mean, my cover FX I think is like $41, I think, $40, $40. This is $8, 8 or 9 So you guys can save some money um, if you guys don't want to, you know, spend so much money on that expensive primer. Um, if you guys like to see these, these type of videos, um, then please give my video a thumbs up. And I can definitely record more for you guys. Um, reviews. I've actually had fun recording this and just following up and carrying my camera around with me uh, to follow up with like how the primer was doing. So um, I love you guys and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, please subscribe and I'll catch you guys in my next one. Bye. You think you broke my heart, oh girl, for goodness. I'm gonna go ahead and keep you guys posted with this. Oh, look at room, you guys. You guys, I can hear you guys. What? Go to the living room. I can hear you guys. Oh, I'm recording. Oh, boy. It's hot as hell. Any shot? Shut up. <laughs> that was fun. My baby, bro. Blurry, isn't it? This is the bro. The broski. Are oh, you recording? <laughs> yeah. Got a new haircut today. It's on fleek. <laughs> You think I'm crying on my own, well I ain't And I didn't want to write a song Cause I didn't want anyone thinking I still care or don't But you still hit my